And with a lot of people relying on shopping online because of the coronavirus, there is a dramatic rise in online shopping complaints in New York State and also across the country. People aren't getting what they ordered, and sometimes they're losing out on big bucks, as we hear from Channel 2's Jeff Preval. And because of the rise in consumer complaints, the State Department of Consumer Protection has sent out an alert to consumers on what to do and what not to do with online shopping. According to the Federal Trade Commission, in April and May, more than 34,000 people reported having problems with online shopping. More than any months on record, online shopping nationally during the first three months of the pandemic was the leading fraud category, resulting in a loss of $45 million. I spoke to one woman who says that several months ago she went on eBay using her PayPal account to buy a clock that still hasn't arrived. And I kept saying over and over that, I, that we got hacked. And um, there was no way for me to prove it. Uh, and essentially, I was out $133.95. In New York State, during the height of the pandemic, according to the FTC, there were more than 4,400 online shopping complaints filed with the agency, which is more than double the number of complaints filed in the spring of 2019. Now, the State Department of Consumer Protection recommends that consumers shop on trusted sites, be wary of third-party vendors, and never store your credit card on any website. I'm Jeff Perval, Channel 2 News.